In these problems, we're doing some addition or subtraction of polynomials, and we need to do that and then simplify uh, the answers. Uh, polynomials are called polynomials. Uh, poly means many, and nomials really means name, or you can think of it as terms. So polynomials have uh, many terms. So we've got a t squared term, a t term, a number term in both of these, and we need to add these together. So what we're really doing is we're adding the t squared terms to each other, then we're adding the t terms to each other, and then we're adding the numbers to each other. So I'm just going to take it in those steps. First, I have 5t squared plus negative 7t squared. That comes out to negative 2. 5 plus a negative 7 is a negative 2t squared. Then we have a negative 3t squared plus 6t squared. That's a positive 3t. Sorry, not t squared, t. And then we have a 1 plus 4, that's 5. And that is our answer. It can get a little trickier with the subtraction. So here we have 2t minus 5 minus this whole quantity. If you can keep it straight in your mind that you're subtracting each of these terms, that'll work. Or you could simply distribute the negative sign and add them. Um, uh, let me show you both ways. Here we have only a t term and a negative uh, 5. So this. 3t squared is going to be a negative 3t squared. It's sort of like saying 0t squared minus 3t squared. That's what uh, equals negative 3t squared. Let's do the, the t term now. We've got 2t minus a negative 6t. So you've got to be careful here. That's, that's a double negative. So 2 minus a negative 6 is the same as 2 plus 6. So this is actually going to be a positive 8t. And then we have a negative 5 minus a negative 5. So that's negative 5 plus 5, or just 0. So our answer is this. So that's just keeping in mind that you're subtracting for each term. The other way to do this is just to simply distribute the negative sign and turn this into an addition problem. Some people find that uh, easier. So let me just rewrite it that way. So we've got our 2t minus 5. And now I'm going to say plus, and we'll um, distribute the negative sign. We've got a negative 3t squared uh, plus 6t, because the negative times the negative, and same with the 5, a plus 5. And then we do the same thing. Uh, we've got no t squared term over here, so we just bring down the negative 3t squared from the uh, second part of this. And then 2t plus 6t is 8t. And a negative 5 plus 5 is 0. We come up with the same thing. So either way you want to do deal with the negative sign, uh, whichever works best for you. So that's a little bit of work with uh, simplifying addition and subtraction of polynomials.